goes in, gates are back. We're off and racing, and after that delay, we got them in a pretty good line. Run, Rudolph Run is pushing forward. Norshan is also handy in the early stages, and Twice Told is going up to join their leading group. They being followed by Marie Mann is also looking for the lead. Destiny's Angel is right there in the thick of things too. Quite a scramble for the early lead and a good pace for a race of this nature. Marshall Field is racing just in behind that leading bunch, and he's only three lengths off them. Lockheed Lightning tracks that one. They being followed by Norshan, who's dropped back on the outside. He's taken hold and easing back through the field. In behind that, Lord Fifield is a He's inside, and Jack Sway is the trailer, and he'd be a dozen lengths off this leader. Twice told, he's out in front as they head down towards the 1,000 meter mark. He has the lead now by two. Run, Rudolph Run is racing up in second. Destiny's Angel races in third as the pace becomes a lot more sedate. Marie Mann is in behind those racing in that fourth placing, followed then on the far side by Hawk Circle, who races back in fifth. Along the inside, Marshall Field is four lengths off the lead. Lockheed Lightning races further back behind that one. They followed then by St. Silas, and he's seven lengths off the leader. Norshan races just in behind that, followed by Lord Fifield. And Jack Sway is still the trailer, and he still this dozen lengths off the leader. They midway round the turn, they go towards the 600 meter mark and twice told he's out in front, he shows the way. Run Rudolph run up on the outside, he's racing back in second. Destiny's Angel back towards the inside, he's in behind those in third. They being followed then by Marie Mann or cornering that fourth placing and Destiny's Angels back towards their inside. Right down the inside, Marshall Field is trying to get into the race too. Norshan is hooked right to the outside for his run as Run Rudolph Run picks it up as they come down to the final 300. Norshan is trying hard up towards the outside. Twice Told is also right there. There are plenty of chances they spread right across the track. Towards the outside, Twice Told might just be in front. Over towards the inside, Marshall Field is coming home gamely. Twice Told, Marshall Field. Twice Told doing just enough, sorry, it's St. Silas rather, St. Silas on the outside, just done enough over Marshall Field. He finishes eight lengths off them. Head on view. Run Rudolph Run was in front at this stage. Towards the outside, it's the four St. Silas, the blue sleeves, the striped cap. Down towards the inside in the light blue, it's the 11 Marshall Field. Marshall Field and St. Silas come forward to join issue. But it's the four St. Silas in the centre who does just enough to edge out 11 Marshall Field. 10 Lord Fifield kicks on best the rest for third. And 8 Run Rudolph Run weakens to finish back in fourth. Race five has been won by number number four, Saint uh, Silas, the, the son of Silvano. Well done to Lucky Jevu, who looks after him and receives his thousand rand from Hollywood Bets. Thank you to them and Cape Racing. Trainer is uh, Eric Sands. Eric, well done. Thank you very much, Vicky. He seems to really enjoy this type of distance. He wants further. He's bred for a lot further. We haven't been at uh, 2000 for a long time. Last time he was way out of his ground through uh, early part in the race, he found a bit of trouble. Uh, but his last two runs he ran on very well and Devon had him nicely placed today. A little bit slow away in the gates and that. But his horse had won 2428. So I'm lucky he's got one on the belt. Great uh, to um, Sandy and you, Eugene Arundel. Uh, Sandy was a little bit upset this morning. Her dog went in for a hop, but I hope this medicine helps. I thank him for their patience and for all the support. Eric, well done. Thank you. That's uh, Eric Sands speaking about uh, San Silas. As he said, loves this type of trip, if not further. He's uh, only a three-year-old, so maybe keep an eye on him through the, the when summer arrives. And uh, over the staying trips, uh, probably one that you can earmark for for those uh, staying type of races. I'm just having a look to see if uh, Devin Ashby's coming back. It would be nice to hear from him. He is uh, going to make a comeback. So I'll just uh, speak about uh, San Silas, bred by Clara Flay Stud. Son of Silvano, as mentioned, and lovely to Eugene and uh, and Sandy, or Sandy and Eugene Arundel, being a full 100% owners of number four, St. Silas. Doesn't look like Devin Ashby's coming back, so well done to him for a very strong ride and uh, in maintaining a, a good finish from this lovely son of Silvano.